What's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are on our Let's Clash account and we are doing some Garching, guys. It's kind of like March, but Garch, Giants, and Archers, uh, and a couple of Wall Breakers. Let's go ahead and start off by watching this replay uh, of this base. It had a lot of loot on it, so I'm going to go ahead and make sure to take out that mortar first off, just because I don't want to deal with the splash damage from that thing on my uh, on my archers as they get in. So we're gonna put um, the majority of our giants over here on this left side, uh, as well as our king. That giant bomb does a good amount of damage to the giants, but uh, we end up being fine. And then I'm gonna drop off the rest of my giants over here and get them in that wall with those wall breakers. Uh, after the fact, I'm realizing that I probably should have uh, dropped off uh, oh, I did do it. I dropped off archers up at the top, but I didn't want to deploy too heavily up there because I did want to get into the center of the base. So you can see our giants are doing a good job right now taking out these defenses. Um, we're going to go ahead and drop off our last two wall breakers, and they are going to flawlessly make it into the center of the base for us, which is exactly where we wanted them to go. Um, now the king is going to turn around. The giants are not. I wish that the giants had turned around as well and had headed towards the middle, but they did not. Um... But we do have 15 more archers. We're going to go ahead and drop those off uh, in just a second now that that wizard tower is gone. We had to make sure that, that splash damage was gone first. Uh, you can see his king is over here doing work to our giants. So they are pretty much a lost cause at this point because we don't have any heal spells or anything. So now we're going to drop off the, f the last 15 of our archers. They're going to come in here, take out that king. And that mortar, thankfully, is focused on our king. So um, our archers are perfectly safe. Uh, you can see that it's still focused on the king right there, so we're able to get into the center, get 263,000 gold from this guy. Uh, there is 100,000 left of everything else. Um, if I'd brought a heal spell, then uh, the raid might have gone a little bit better, um, but it still wasn't bad. That is a good amount of loot, and we got at least two-thirds of it, so I am perfectly fine with that. You can see that we ended up with 263,000 gold, 241,000 elixir that is awesome and then we ended up taking out the town hall um as well so that's what we wanted but you can see that we have another guard trained up right here we got six wall breakers uh 15 giants and a whole bunch of archers for us now one thing that a bunch of you guys commented on the last video uh that i noticed uh is that i need to finish upgrading my mortar so i've got this last one right here we're going to start off the video upgrading that last mortar it is going to be done in five days all these other mortars are maxed for town hall eight um and then all of our wizards are maxed now which is freaking awesome uh i get so many requests for town hall nine like base builds and stuff that i really want to get back up to town hall nine so i might start um just crushing on this base and just uh barching like crazy filling up my gold filling up all my resources um, I don't know if I'll be able to get my king up to level 10, uh, but I definitely want to get him up to like at least 7 or 8, somewhere around there before we get up to 9, um, and then get all of the walls up. So let me know what you guys think about that, but we're going to go ahead and go on an attack here, and I'll be back with you guys in just a couple seconds once I find a base that is what, guys? Worthy of attacking. That's right. I'll see you guys in just a few seconds. All right, guys. Here we go so this base looks awesome that is a whole bunch of loot and we definitely want to get as much of it as we can um it looks like a lot of it is in the center of the base so let's see let's see how much is out here i don't know attack the gold let's see uh yeah so a lot of it is in the center um well it's going down by about a thousand each time so uh it's in the center and not in the center. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and we're going to take out this mortar right here. Um, and I'm going to just drop off all of my giants up here. And we're going to get in a couple of wall breakers, see if we can get them in there for us. Uh, drop off some more archers up here and get a couple more wall breakers up in there. Come on, guys. Get inside. Get inside. <clears throat> Once we clear out some of these buildings outside, then we can... Um, deploy some more of our archers and whatnot uh, so we'll go ahead and drop off the king as well and let's start taking out some of these buildings over here thankfully this guy does have his 
fourth mortar upgrading. Uh, so we're going to be able to take out a good amount of his loot. If we can uh, get our giants around this side, yep, yeah, right there, where they're going right now, then we should be good to go. Hopefully we can take out this wizard tower uh, with those giants, but I don't know if they're going to be able to get through the wall before the wizard tower takes them out. So hopefully the archer towers, okay, the archers took them out. So we should be able to get in here to this gold then um, and take all of that out. I really want us to get in there to that dark elixir. Uh, but I don't think that we will be able to. But it looks like a lot of it is in that pump right there. Awesome. So where's his other... Uh, oh, never mind. All right, so we're going to go ahead and take out the rest of this elixir right here. And maybe if we can get our... Ah, I wish that our archers would have uh, gone for that mortar right there. Let's see if we can... It looks like he might have some loot inside of his clan castle. So our archers might be out of range of everything over here. Nope, they're in range of that wizard tower. But they are going to get in there and at least take out some of his clan castle loot. Um, and we're not going to get the town hall, but that is okay because we just got a great amount of loot uh, of loot from that raid. Let's go ahead and end that battle. We got 56% to 316,000 gold, guys. Woo! 155,000 elixir. And then that loot bonus... That's a good raid. That is a good find. Super, super stoked about that. Um, we'll go ahead and train that up again. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we'll do. Um, let's throw in a heal this time. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we're going to throw in some archers. And I think it's about like 21 minutes or so. It might be a little bit more, uh, which is why. I wish that uh, I could get some more gym boxes on this base so that I could just boost my barracks all the time because it makes it so much faster. Uh, so yeah, that's what it ends up being, about 22 minutes. Um, so you can get in a couple raids per hour. If you want to do that strategy, of course, Barch is a lot faster. Uh, but a bunch of you guys don't like seeing Barch, even though Barch is love and Barch is life. Barch is life, Barch is love. Uh, you can't beat it. Let's see if we can upgrade anything else. So we've got a good amount of elixir right now. Um, our Teslas, this one's level 4, obviously we can't do that, that one's level 4, we've got a level 5 up here, nice. So we need 2 million gold to do that, uh, our air defenses are all maxed out at level 6, our mortars are about to be maxed out, guys we are doing good, we are doing really really good, do we have any mines or pumps that are level 10? 11, I don't even check those anymore, 11, 11. 11, 11, all right. Oh, ha, look at that. Upgrade, there we go. We found one. We found one, guys. <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, 11, 11. All right, so we're good there. Uh, we are about to finally max out our collectors. Let's see what else we can do. Oh, does not Does that need to be? No, okay. That's um, <laughs> I mix up my accounts so much. My uh, Clash Without Walls account still needs to upgrade one of its uh, army camps. So let's see here. We've got two more builders. We've got two million elixir and a million gold. I kind of want to, I mean, I could upgrade the storage. Um, let's go ahead and just do that. So we'll upgrade that storage right there. And then I guess we can call it maybe, I don't know, upgrade this joint or something. We'll upgrade that and then we'll call it. So thank you so much for watching, guys. That was a great last raid on that. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Leave a like down below if you did. Also, make sure you check out my second channel. I'm playing Destiny, Call of Duty, Plunder Pirates, Minecraft on there with Nick at Night from Teach Boom Beach. So check out that. It's Molt Plays. Uh, go subscribe over there for some awesome content as well. But thank you so much for watching, guys. And as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.